Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the recycle bin is greyed out on Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to re-add the recycle bin icon. Now to do this, right click on your desktop on an empty space and select the personalize option. And in here what you have to do is click on the teams category, then afterwards scroll down until you find the desktop icon settings and just click on this option. You'll see that a new window will appear and what you have to do in here, you have a few options related to desktop icons and this includes the recycle bin icon. What you have to do is just untick the box next to it, click on apply and then again tick the box next to recycle bin. And and click on apply for it to show up once again and click on ok to save the changes. Now you can just check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to use the group policy editor. To do this press the windows button then simply type gpedit.msc or group policy and then select it from the search results. Now in here navigate to the following path, user configuration, then open up administrative templates and afterwards open up desktop. And now in here on the right side make sure to locate the remove recycle bin icon from desktop option, double click on it and make sure that the not configured option is selected. Now just click on apply and ok to save the changes and restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And lastly another useful solution is to use the registry editor. To do this press the windows button then simply type reg edit and select registry editor from the search results. And in here navigate to the following location, H key local machine, then expand software, afterwards scroll way down until you find the Microsoft key and expand it, then again scroll way down until you find the windows key and then you have to expand it, then expand current version, move further until you will find the policies key, expand it once again and then click on the non enum key. Now in here what you have to do is locate the following D word value. What you have to do is double click on it and then make sure to set the value data to zero. Now press on OK, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And in case you do not have this key, right click on an empty space in here on the right side, hover over new and select the D word value. Now simply type this number and afterwards save it and again double click on it and set the value to zero. Now you can just close this window, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, super simple isn't it? Of course if this video helped you make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching and I wish you a great day.